Are you and Destin just a little bit bored right now? Well, in this video, I'm gonna tell you five things that I think you should be doing right now while you're in Destin. So stay tuned. What's up everybody? Gary O'Leary here with another video. First off, I wanna thank you for clicking on this video. And if you haven't already, make sure you hit that subscribe button and click on that notifications bell so you're notified each and every time I post a video. So like I said, if you're just a little bit bored and you're hanging out in Destin, I've got five things that I think you'll enjoy doing. So let's get started. So coming in at number one is the beaches. So Destin is known for its beaches. It's got warm, crystal clear water that you have no problem running into and swimming around. So if you're in the mood to maybe lay out in the sun and get that suntan, then put your swim trunks on, grab your suntan lotion, and head out. Some of the beaches that I recommend are Henderson State Beach Park, James Lee Beach, and Noriega Point. So Henderson State Beach Park is about $5 to park, but it's a little bit less crowded and I think it allows you to do a little bit more than what you want instead of being crowded in with a bunch of people. The other two beaches, and Noriega Point especially, can get a little bit crowded, but they're right on the Gulf, obviously. They're beautiful. It's always got great sunsets if you're there throughout the whole day, as well as there's always a lot of people so you can get that socializing in, or if you want, you can kind of keep it to yourself, but there is a little bit more people there. Especially at Noriega Point, they do have little coves that your kids can run into, so you don't have to worry about them swimming out and being caught up in any tides or any dangerous areas. So if you have kids and you, want, you don't want to worry about them swimming, the Noriega Point might be for you. Coming in at number two is Crab Island. So needless to say, Crab Island is probably the main attraction of Destin. It's where everybody likes to go, everybody from you know 15 years old all the way up to you know elderly. If you have a boat or you want to rent one, head out to Crab Island. I highly recommend it. It's a ton of fun. It's where everybody just goes to party, you know, hang out with friends and just spend the day doing whatever they'd like. It's a lot of fun. And if you don't know where it is, it's right inside the Destin Harbor. So right on the other side of the bridge, inside the harbor actually. And you'll see it as you cross over the bridge into Destin. Coming in at number three is the Destin Harbor Walk. The Harbor Walk is a ton of fun no matter how old you are. It's got activities for kids as well as all the things you would want to do as an adult. It's got bars and restaurants as well as a zip line if you're really into that. But regardless, if you want to go out and hang out and look over the Gulf in the evening, or just at sunset and get some amazing views, I highly recommend going to any of the restaurants or bars on the Harbor Walk. My personal favorite is AJ's. I like going there during the evenings with friends and family just to kind of hang out, have a few drinks, enjoy each other's company, as well as during large events like the Super Bowl, for example, they always have something going on where you can watch it on their big TVs. It's a ton of fun and I highly recommend just hitting up the Harbor Walk if you're bored. Coming in at number four is golf. Now, I don't know how much of an avid golfer any of you are, but for me, I love going. I find it a lot of fun, and there's plenty of beautiful golf courses here on the Emerald Coast, especially in Destin. I personally like to go out to Indian Bayou. My brother and my dad always love going out there. We'll go out there maybe once every couple weeks. Uh, I personally am terrible, but I still enjoy it. But uh, I always recommend going to uh, Indian Bayou, giving that one a go, as well as Regatta Bay and Emerald Bay. Both beautifully uh, kept courses. Uh, all three of them, in fact, have incredible views as well as just some of the best courses you'll ever play on. Lush greens, uh, well-kept fairways, and a lot of lot of fun, especially challenging uh, hazards in the way. So if you like golf, I recommend hitting up any of the golf courses that are in Destin. And in that fact, hitting up any of the golf courses just in the whole Emerald Coast in general, you can have fun no matter what. So coming in at number five is the Destin Commons. The Destin Commons is just an outdoor mall. It's got all the shops and retail stores you'd expect from really any mall or any outlet area. I mean, for example, Forever 21, H&M, I mean, pretty much everything you can imagine. So you have plenty of retail therapy you can get involved in. Or if you're just there just to hang out, maybe do a little bit of window shopping. It's got plenty of bars and restaurants where you can stop in, enjoy lunch or dinner, whatever you want. Plus, it's got activities for kids. It's got plenty of little small playgrounds in the area, as well as it's got a movie theater where you can watch all the coolest movies and newest movies that are out. Uh, what makes this movie theater interesting is it's got Dolby uh, Audio, which is some of those awesome surround sound type things you don't get in every movie theater. This one is super cool, so if you watch any action movies, or really any movie for that matter. It's got really good spatial audio, so it really feels like you're immersed into the film. So it's really awesome. I highly recommend checking out the Destin Commons if you're bored. Well, that pretty much wraps up this video. If you haven't already, subscribe, hit that notifications bell, and you'll know each and every time I post a video. If you're considering moving or selling your house here in Destin, Florida, go ahead and reach out to me. You can, I'll leave my contact information right here, and you can send me a text, give me a call, or shoot me an email, and I'll reach out to you as soon as I can. So I'll see you in the next video, guys. Have a good one.